Hello everyone, it's Jim again. Today I'm going to be doing a brand new reaction film, and this time I'm going to react to Brendan Taylor of a video of his that he uploaded from yesterday. And the video I'm going to be react to do is called Eating at the Best Reviewed Pizza Restaurant in Nashville Taste Test. So, so yeah, I'm going to react to do it. And for Michael Vlogs, if you're watching this reaction film, <laughs> Pizza Reaction! <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to react to do it. So before I want to start, I want to give a disclaimer. If you do not like content make, the reaction bills, or any of the other stuff in my channel, if you don't like them, then don't watch because we're else. Because the only thing you don't want is give me a view, and that's the damn truth one. That's the damn truth, and nothing but the truth. So yeah. So now without further ado, let's get the video right now. Let's get it right now. Pizza is a big deal for me. I love a good pie. National oh, yeah. locals have highly recommended this place pizza, behind pizza. me. I'm with a national that local right now. What do you think of this spot? It's honestly, it's my go-to pizza in town. Hmm. Okay, huh. so let's go see how fire this pizza really is here in Nashville. <laughs> Come on. Do I run over in Nashville? I'm not really go to that place. How's the pizza here, guys? Good? All right, good to know. <laughs> First thoughts in here. It seems like a cool open spot. We're in East <laughs> Nashville right now, which is more of like the hipster type vibe style here. And I can see it with the paintings. It looks <laughs> like a cool open bar. I don't know how good it's going to be, but the reviews online, it's got literally 4,000, almost five star reviews <laughs> on Google, 1,500 on Yelp. That's saying something to me. So let's check out this menu. <laughs> yeah, can we get the bearded iris? Uh, what's a great blonde that you have besides yourself, of course? Oh! Is that one oh you? my god. <laughs> so really? I don't drink a lot of beer. Uh, <laughs> no, no, he was video saving me. Oh, okay. Then camera shot. Uh, don't be. <laughs> You should be a model. You're not, you're not on camera. Okay. Come say hi. Come on. Uh, Come say you hi. gotta break the ice. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do that one. Sure. But we're also ready to order. We want to do a 14 inch a half and half pie. So we want to get the uh, South Brooklyn for half, and then the other half we want to do this habanero cream sauce pie. Is that one good? Oh boy. Is it good. Is it really spicy though? It's pretty spicy. That's what I want. Oh. I don't like cream tea. Okay. Have the sauce on the side. No, no, I want it on. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, perfect. I think she lost me, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, like, I I with a straw? No. Uh. Okay. Poppy, hazy, feels like a summer vibe. Just how you like it. Cheers. I just got whatever the cute girl behind the bar recommended, and oh. I'm gonna go like my big brother, get my straw out. <laughs> he likes the straw. Mine tastes like a real faint light beer. Like it's real faint. It's almost like water. It's almost like a Bud Light. I, it's almost like a Bud Light. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's almost like a Bud Light. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't think that's cancelable. Listen, we're out here, we're foodies, we're food reviewers. You know, my audience is really cool as hell, so we're not 12 year old blue haired people behind a keyboard trying to cancel people. So cheers to y'all. This beer is for y'all. It's Memorial Day today. I think Jake and I should have a good old chug off. What do you think? No, I can't right now. Come on. We'll have a check-off later. After the video. What the people want to see. <laughs> oh, okay. And maybe no check-off. So, we're going to start with the habanero side. I want to see what the hold is. Let's see the stiffness test. Okay, you know, it's floppy. But listen, all good things come with a flop. Ain't that right, oh, yeah. Jake? Mine starts with the flop, but it definitely gets a little flop, harder. Flop. We're in the flop era anyway, so. How many races do you guys want? Uh, you want how one? How many can you hold? <laughs> Three? <laughs> Try one of Ricky, you know, Oh, of course. She's such a sweetheart. Oh, I love Nashville women. Okay, so we're gonna go for this habanero cream. There's always something interesting about when they combine habanero with anything because it's just turning the spice level up in her mouth. So let's just go for it, Jake. My man. Um, burn my lips all the uh -oh. season is. Mm. It's like an undertone habanero. A nice heat up in your mouth, but nothing too crazy. Nothing that would deter us Thank away. You. Thank you. Do you want to sit down and have a slice with us? Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I don't know. I'm going to play it out like Dave Portnoy. I had one bite, but I'm going to go for a 
shotgun. Yeah, we're going to... Dave Portnoy rated this place a 7.5, so let's remember that, and let's rate it ourselves, okay? So I'm going to go... He calls it the one bite, but he's really eating the whole freaking slice, so... It's a solid pizza. Very yeah, easy. I no. will say the undercarriage of it is a little yeah. rough on my end. Like, I usually like a little bit doughier type of crust. This is like it's hockey a, puck style. Yeah, a little bit more crusty. I'm not going to lie, though. I do like a little bit of a crunch with my pizza. It is a nice little complimentary to the soft dough of the top and the cheesiness. Mm, it kind of all goes together in your mouth. I have to rate this habanero one specifically. I'm going to have to kind of agree with Portnoy or a little bit less, maybe like a 7-4. Yeah. I, I think it's a solid pizza, something I would come back to, but it's not the best thing I've ever tried in my life. No, that was good. Wait a minute. All right, listen, Jake, you do this again. I'm going to file a charge. Uh, Sorry. So we're with the Nashville local now. This was the side that he wanted. This is the, which one is this? The this South is, Brooklyn. We got the <laughs> South Brooklyn. I can definitely tell you it's a lot more floppy than the habanero <laughs> cream. Look how cheesy that is. Uh, That's interesting. Let's go for it. Looks like it's just like a normal, looks like a normal. That like is really a, good like, pizza, like I'm not going to lie right good. there. I think that one's right, almost right, a little bit better pizza. than the habanero one. I like a little something extra on topping, hmm. but when it comes here, I love their cheese. Right, hmm. I've never been a guy who orders just cheese pizza. This cheese pizza in particular, it's got a real good flavor to it. The way hmm. that they season the pizza and the marinara underneath, it's got some real good flavors coming out, hmm. and it's not just a cheesy mess. It's a little kick to it. But really, it does. I was almost thinking, was that the habanero <laughs> cream, or no, is that no. this one? This is the first slice I've had, and it's got a little bit it's it definitely sure. got a little spice level to it. So this place is interesting. I'm going to rate this one right here. I'll give this one a 7-7. Seven, seven. I like that. I like seven, this seven, one. This good. one's a little bit better than the other one. Honestly, I like this one. This is good. You want to give it a go, Jake? Definitely a lot more floppy, though. A little flop. Flop, 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 flop. That one's good. That one's almost like, I don't know. It feels like a cheese soup that they laid on it's top of so it. It's so good. It's so creamy and so good. No ranch needed. No chili flakes needed. No parmesan needed. Nothing needed. I can eat that all day long. <laughs> Oh, rain it. Yeah, seven seven. I agree fully. All right, y'all heard it. We'll check back when the bill comes. <laughs> Being asked if the Instagram is good. Go for it. Do you hear how he talks to his boss? Tell him that. You're my employee. You're my worker servant. Would you ever talk to your boss like that? I do. That's what's wrong with this generation. That's why Gen Z is better than you guys. That's probably why I get promoted. <laughs> <laughs> Hope he's like I'm sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. And quick question, if you do appear in the video, do you want me to blur you or are you okay being in? Oh, don't worry about it. Okay, cool. And then our last thing I want to know is, what's your Instagram? I can write it down for you. Yeah, you please. Yeah. I would, it's for my personal self, not for the video. Oh. 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 Keep the Instagram. Thank you, though. Oh. Poor Brennan. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> sometimes we strike out, but we try every oh, time. Oh, no. Have you ever done that, Jake? Oh, sh that's that hilarious. That is hilarious, man. That's, that's hilarious. hilarious. What's the total? Oh, sorry. I'm still laughing at this moment. Um, okay, here's oh, whoa. Something got <laughs> What the well, That is very cheap. It's the cheapest pizza. She only tried for a third. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, she split them all it. Together. She Just split tell her one check. All right, so this is the total. <laughs> just times three. <laughs> 30 bucks. So 30 bucks. Listen, huh. y'all, I just want to give the boys a quick lesson out there because I know you guys look at me as the Riz Lord and the Rizzler and the Riz Wizard, you know, the Rizzard. I get it. Listen, and I want to tell you guys, sometimes we're going to strike out. It's normal. Don't be afraid of striking out because you miss every ball you don't strike at. You know what I mean? We're not trying to catch balls here. We're trying to strike. You know? <laughs> All right, you guys, so there you have it. Some pizza in Nashville. Honestly, not bad at all. I definitely want to keep that 7.7 .7 rating. We're going to try a couple more of the highly rated spots here in Nashville and let you guys know what we think of it. Until next time, I love you, and I'll see you later. Peace. And I'm going to be WWE right there. Just so yeah. And that's the end of this race spell. And I hope you guys like this race spell. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care, and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those navigate bells on every time I upload, and share my bills, and react bills, and other bills that do my, other bills that do my channel, to your friends, but you also you want, it's your choice, because I am making it so, so yeah. And don't forget to subscribe to Brandon Taylor if you're new, subscribe to his channel if you haven't yet, subscribe if you haven't yet, subscribe if you haven't yet, subscribe. And road to 3k subscribers, hope we can hit, and of uh, See y'all for more banger content coming in, more banger, banger reactions, and more banger content. So, and I'll see you next time. Super Jordan signing out, and peace out, Jordan Legends, and peace out, everyone.